In the previous video, we looked on the result layer and added the link absolute flow. Now we will create a profile plot. Turn off the result layer by ticking off the box. Go to the ribbon map, where you can find the options for Profile Manager. Click on Set Flags to select the tool. With these flags, you can specify the boundaries for your profile plot. We will set two flags. The first one is the beginning point of our profile plot and the second one is the end point. Now you can click on Profile Manager to open the profile plot. Some default values are already shown, for example the IDs, the length and the junction elevation. Now we want to add a result file. Go to the toolbar and select Add Item. We need to select a result file. In our case, we just have this one result file. The item that we want to add is the node head. Click on Add. We can now see the results for the node head within our water distribution network. You can add more results if you want to. Furthermore, properties can be changed by right-clicking on the profile plot and choosing the option Properties. Go to the tab Graphical Styles. Here you can change the graphical styles for the different elements. For example, we can change the color of the node head that we have just added to our profile plot. There is also a quick toolbar for the properties, which can be found when clicking on this small arrow. Choose the layer that you want to change the appearance for. Now you can again change different settings. For example, we can change the line thickness. In the next video, we will have a look on result tables.